guys, so we just left Portsmouth Harbour, it's 8.30 on Friday night and the Jets of Coco Chelsea Morgan and I are heading over to the Isle of Wight for 2016's festival. Super excited because we've been invited this year by SDA Travel and they have a pop-up venue uh, on site where we're going to be actually staying. I think we're in for a magical weekend. Basically being made to decant my prosecco into a plastic bottle. We're not allowed glass. <laughs> not gonna taste the same. It's not gonna taste the same. It's not gonna taste the same. Should have drunk it on the train. Should have drunk it. I told you. little room I am so so thankful that we have proper beds to sleep in something that every girl at a festival dreams of being able to see her full entire body because I don't know about you but whenever I go to a festival I only know what my face looks like for the majority of the three days <laughs> you can choose face or outfit face or outfit yeah. so we've all been given a little gift pack by STA guys um, in it we've got our lanyard with the lineup um, schedule of stuff that's going on at the hostel breakfast bar lanyard chewing gum like recycling thing to put your chewing gum in bottle of water more breakfast bars wet wipes very handy for i think major laser has just gone onto the main stage so we're gonna have a few drinks and we're just putting on our makeup uh, got the obligatory glitter highlight all over my face and some like electric blue liner i've just made a little cocktail for us this is prosecco vodka and red bull so we're just downing a few of these and then we're gonna head out and see what happens. Cheers! Cheers! So, Emily thinks that she can get her whole body yonder. Yeah, this is a security cage for us, but I reckon I can get in that and fit. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna film her getting in. I'm not even gonna take my shoes off, that's how sure I am I can get in here without even removing any articles of clothing. You ready to be amazed? I'm always ready to be amazed. Honestly, I've got this. No. Turn your head bit like squidge a bit more. You can push it shut. Okay, hold on, let me just push it shut. No! No! <laughs> oh my god! No! <laughs> You're so evil! I trusted you! Oh. I'm not sure this is a good look for me. What do you think? You'll remember when you turn up in the same outfit. Brush your teeth. Are you eating crisps? I don't know if we can be friends. I don't look so pleased about it. <laughs> The rain has not stopped since we woke up this morning. So we're in our room still, we've just decided to chuck on a load of glitter and just do our faces and then sort of kind of wait for it to ease off a bit and then head out. So the guys at SDA came in this morning and kindly gave us wellies to wear. Only mine are like really, really short. They're like cropped ones. Carry on, no love, no admission. 
And she's like, oh yeah, mine's coming off really easily too. I'm like, <laughs> wait, let me just show you. <laughs> it's all over my face, it's on my teeth, <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> like, I'm gonna. <laughs> we call this disco acne. I mean, I struggle with the acne under my eyes and around my nose. <laughs> How are you? Um, like, no, no. this eye is very bad. <laughs> you look quite cool. But like you can't, you can't live your life like this. You can't live your life like that. It's in my eyeballs. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking here, Patrick. <laughs> You're a whole lot of woman. <laughs> Sunday, day three at Leicester and the sun has come out to play, finally. The ground does not look like a disgusting mess anymore. And we get to go out without jumpers. Yes. The good thing about being in this travel hostel is when you open your bedroom door, you are literally always got a party going on behind you. You got me feeling like I can't believe I let you go. I've been alone so long. Now I wonder what the hell we were thinking of It's just, it's just, it's just a massive spectacle. It's great. 